In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make a phenomenal beat for me, Mill. It's it's like a crazy hit beat for me, Mill. So watch this video till the end, and I will say, let's up straight into FL Studio. Hey. Let's copy the bottom note of our chords and to just add some low frequencies. Let's copy the melody over and let's select the middle notes of our chords and let's put them one octave higher. So we have a little switch up in the 8 bar loop. notes right now just a little bit yeah exactly like this and now we just randomize the velocity of our notes right here first we strum them a little bit and right now we just gonna randomize the velocity of the notes maybe a different arp Let's add the equalizer 2 on it and we make a low cut at let's say 90 hertz right here and then we add a little bit delay on it, set the time up right here to 4 steps, feedback to ping pong and the volume knob in the input area. Yeah, I would say to around 8 or 10% like in between of that but it really depends on your style and we add a little bit reverb on it. A fire and our flute melody we also add a little bit delay on that one and like a lot of reverb because I want the flute like roomy AF so
Let's put those notes right here, some semitones down and we put like a regular two-step uh, hi-hat pattern on it, like this, you know. Hey, and now we just bring a little bounce in it right here, just like this. Second close height right here, rich on fill each four steps. So we just add a nice head bumping effect to it, you know. We already have a very bouncy hi hat pattern, but yeah, we spice it up a little bit, you know. Just like this. And we turn up like every fourth. Hey guys, and right now let's just add a fire kick to make this beat punchy AF. Let's just add the uh, equalizer 2 to our 808 recrig and let's just drag up the mid frequencies right here. Alright guys, so right here is a little structure for you that I made, so you can listen to the full beat. So a little intro melody, the voice tag. If you want to watch another video where I've also made a fire fire beat for Meek Mill, then check out that video right here on the screen. This beat also turned out like a fire fire beat for him, so go and check it out. And I will say we see us in two days. Hey.